previous three presidential elections, Minnesota has been considered a battleground state with multiple visits by major candidates. This year, not so much. We did have a visit, though, by Libertarian candidate Gary Johnson today. Gary Johnson doesn't look like a traditional presidential candidate. That's exactly why 200 people showed up at McAllister College to listen to his non-traditional views. I am the only candidate that does not want to bomb Iran. He also wants to pull all U.S. troops out of Afghanistan immediately. This explains the peace sign on his T-shirt. Gary Johnson didn't just come out of nowhere. He's a former two-term governor of New Mexico who initially ran for the GOP presidential nomination. You might remember appearances with Minnesota Governor Tim Pawlenty and others in national debates. So we have the highest corporate income tax in the world. He sounded like a Republican then, but now he sounds much more libertarian. I am the only candidate advocating eliminating income tax, corporate tax, abolishing the IRS and replacing all of that with one federal consumption tax. He gets the attention of people tired of Democrats and Republicans. They're both the same. There's really no difference between the two. So. We definitely need a change. I thought it was great. It's a lot more refreshing. It's not the same crap that you hear from the two parties. What if you all waste your vote and vote for me? I'm the next president of the United States. Thank you very much. Thank you. He scared me when he pounded on that podium. Gary Johnson will be on the Minnesota ballot in November. He's also on the ballot in 46 other states and the District of Columbia. He says he expects to gain access through the courts to the final three states very soon. And you heard him say that uh, a vote for him would not be a wasted vote. So it is fitting that former Minnesota Governor Jesse Ventura was there campaigning with him today. All and of right. course, that was Jesse Ventura's famous line yep. from 1998, a vote for him was not a wasted vote. And of course, he and went yeah, on to win. Look what happened with him.